then they opened their treasures and presented him with gifts of gold, frankincense and myrrh. And having been warned in a dream not to go back to Herod, they returned to their country by another route. The men give Jesus some presents. Gifts fit for a king. They clearly aren't poor men. But what about us? Most of us aren't rich. We can't afford to give gifts of gold and expensive perfume. What can we give him? If you were visiting Jesus, dead in that house, what would you take as a gift? What would you want to offer him today? In the hymn, in the bleak midwinter, which we so often sing at Christmas, there are these words. What can I give him? Poor as I am, if I were a shepherd, I would give a lamb. If I were a wise man, I would do my part. But what I can, I give him. Give him my heart. These words get to the nub of the matter. Yes, we can give money and material things and even our talents for the work of the kingdom. But ultimately, it is our heart that Jesus demands of his disciples. A heart that is willing to follow him and learn from him.